Luxembourgish, Luxembourgish, Luck SM Burgish, or Letzburgish, Letzburgish, Letz, or Letzburgish, Letz, Luxembourgish, Letzburgish is a West Germanic language that is spoken mainly in Luxembourg. About 390,000 people speak Luxembourgish worldwide. A variety of the Moselle Franconian language, Luxembourgish has similarities with other varieties of Moselle Franconian and the wider group of West Germanic languages. However, the status of Luxembourgish as an official language in Luxembourg and the existence there of a regulatory body, has removed Luxembourgish, at least in part, from the domain of Standard German, its traditional Dachsprache. <laughs> <laughs> language family Luxembourgish belongs to the West Central German group of High German languages and is the primary example of a Moselle Franconian language. Topic Usage. Luxembourgish is the national language of Luxembourg and one of three administrative languages, alongside French and German. In Luxembourg, 50.9% of citizens can speak Luxembourgish. Luxembourgish is also spoken in the Arillerland region of Belgium part of the province of Luxembourg and in small parts of Lorraine in France. In the German Eiffel and Hunsrück regions, similar local Moselle-Franconian dialects of German are spoken. The language is also spoken by a few descendants of Luxembourg immigrants in the United States and Canada. Additionally, in the German Eiffel and Hunsrück regions, similar local Moselle-Franconian dialects of German are spoken. Other Moselle Franconian dialects are spoken by ethnic Germans long settled in Transylvania, Romania. Moselle Franconian dialects outside the Luxembourg state border tend to have far fewer French loan words, and these mostly remain from the French Revolution. Varieties <inaudible> 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 There are several distinct dialect forms of Luxembourgish including Arler from Arlen, Echternocher Echternach, Clearwer Clairvaux, Misseler Moselle, Stater Luxembourg, Vayner Vianden, Miniter Southern Luxembourg and Wielzer Wilts. Further small vocabulary differences may be seen even between small villages. Increasing mobility of the population and the dissemination of the language through mass media such as radio and television are leading to a gradual standardization towards a Standard Luxembourgish through the process of coinization. Topic: <inaudible> Surrounding languages. There is no distinct geographic boundary between the use of Luxembourgish and the use of other closely related High German dialects, for example Lorraine Franconian. It instead forms a dialect continuum of gradual change. Spoken Luxembourgish is relatively hard to understand for speakers of German who are generally not familiar with Moselle Franconian dialects or at least other West Central German dialects. However, they can usually read the language to some degree. For those Germans familiar with Moselle Franconian dialects, it is relatively easy to understand and speak Luxembourgish as far as the everyday vocabulary is concerned. However, the large number of French loanwords in Luxembourgish may hamper communication about certain topics, or with certain speakers who use many French loanwords. There is no intelligibility between Luxembourgish and French or any of the Romance dialects spoken in the adjacent parts of Belgium and France. Erna Hennecott Schoges, president of the Christian Social People's Party of Luxembourg 1995 2003, was active in promoting the language beyond Luxembourg's borders. Written Luxembourgish Topic Standardization A number of proposals for standardizing the orthography of Luxembourgish can be documented, going back to the middle of the 19th century. There was no officially recognized system, however, until the adoption of the OLO Officiel Leseberer Orthographie on 5 June 1946. This orthography provided a system for speakers of all varieties of Luxembourgish to transcribe words the way they pronounced them, rather than imposing a single, standard spelling for the words of the language. The rules explicitly rejected certain elements of German orthography e.g., the use of a and o, the capitalization of nouns. Similarly, new principles were adopted for the spelling of French loanwords, Feierage, Reihelen, Schwest, Weinaher, cf. 
German Vorigen, Regeln, Schwatzt, Weniger, Bolt, Opera, Charles, Systeme, cf. French Bulletin, Emprunt, Charles, Systeme. This proposed orthography, so different from existing foreign standards that people were already familiar with, did not enjoy widespread approval. A more successful standard eventually emerged from the work of the Committee of Specialists charged with the task of creating the Luxemburger Wörterbuch, published in five volumes between 1950 and 1977. The orthographic conventions adopted in this decades-long project, set out in Bruck 1955, provided the basis of the standard orthography that became official on 10 October 1975. Modifications to this standard were proposed by the Conseil Permanent de la Langue Luxembourgeoise and adopted officially in the spelling reform of 30 July 1999. A detailed explanation of current practice for Luxembourgish can be found in Shannon and Lulling Alphabet <laughs> 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 The Luxembourgish alphabet consists of the 26 Latin letters plus three letters with diacritics A, A, and E. In loanwords from French and Standard German, other diacritics are usually preserved French, Boit, Enkeet, Piker, etc. German, Blod, Bun, but German Buna, etc. Eiffel or Regel Like many other varieties of Western High German, Luxembourgish has a rule of final end deletion in certain contexts. The effects of this rule, known as the Eiffel rule, are indicated in writing, and therefore must be taken into account when spelling words and morphemes ending in n or nn. For example, wan ek gin, when I go, but wa mer gin, when we go. Fenefandresig, 35, but fenefavertsig, 45. Topic Phonology Topic Consonants The consonant inventory of Luxembourgish is quite similar to that of Standard German. P F occurs only in loanwords from Standard German. Just as among many native German speakers, it tends to be simplified to F word initially. For example, flicked obligation is pronounced flit, or in careful speech, p flit. V is realized as w when it occurs after k, t, s, e.g. zwe, t, s, w, e, two. D, z appears only in a few words, such as spadzeiren, p, d, z, een, to go for a walk. D occurs only in loanwords from English. Chi have two types of allophones, alveolopalatal and uvular chi. The latter occur before back vowels, whereas the former occur in all other positions. The allophone appears only in a few words. Note that an increasing number of speakers do not distinguish between the alveolopalatal allophones of chi and the postalveolar phonemes. Younger speakers tend to vocalize the word final to a central vowel or topic vowels. The front rounded vowels, y, y, o stroke, o, appear only in loanwords from French and Standard German. In loanwords from French, nasal, o tilde, also occur. e, has two allophones. Before velars, close mid front unrounded, e, which for some speakers may be open mid, this is especially frequent before. Exactly the same variation applies to, o, except that it is back rounded. All other positions, mid-central vowel, more often slightly rounded than unrounded. Phonetically, the long mid-vowels, e, o, are raised close mid near close e, o, and may even overlap with, i, u, e, before, is realized as. A, is the long variant of, not, a, which does not have a long counterpart, o, appears only in loanwords from Standard German. The first elements of, ash, ash, may be phonetically short, a, in fast speech or in unstressed syllables. The ash and ash contrasts arose from the former lexical tone contrast. The shorter were used in words with accent one, whereas the lengthened ash ash were used in words with accent two. Topic: Grammar. Topic. 
Topic: <laughs> Nominal syntax. Luxembourgish has three genders: masculine, feminine, and neuter, and has three cases: nominative, accusative, and dative. These are marked morphologically on determiners and pronouns. As in German, there is no morphological gender distinction in the plural. The forms of the articles and of some selected determiners are given below. As seen above, Luxembourgish has plural forms of n, a, n, namely eng in the nominative, accusative and ingen in the dative. They are not used as indefinite articles, which, as in German and English, do not exist in the plural, but they do occur in the compound pronouns yn, what, which, and su n, such. For example, y eng sahen, what things, su eng sahen, such things. Moreover, they are used before numbers to express an estimation, eng 30.000 spectatoren, some 30,000 spectators. Distinct nominative forms survive in a few nominal phrases such as der Diwil, the devil, and Iser Hergot, our lord. Rare examples of the genitive are also found, enn des mounts, end of the month, ufanks der woch, at the beginning of the week. The functions of the genitive are normally expressed using a combination of the dative and a possessive determiner, e.g. dem man sai book lit. To the man his book. i.e. the man's book. This is known as a periphrastic genitive, and is a phenomenon also commonly seen in dialectal and colloquial German, and in Dutch. The forms of the personal pronouns are given in the following table unstressed forms appear in parentheses. The two-place form is also used as a polite singular like French vu, CTV distinction. The forms are capitalized in writing. Why Hughes do de concert font? How did you informal SG, like the concert? Why hut dir de concert font? How did you informal place like the concert? Why hut dir de concert font? How did you formal SG, or place like the concert? Like most varieties of colloquial German, but even more invariably, Luxembourgish uses definite articles with personal names. They are obligatory and not to be translated. De Serge as in der Kitchen. Serge is in the kitchen. A feature Luxembourgish shares with only some Western dialects of German is that women and girls are most often referred to with forms of the neuter pronoun hat. Dat as den Athali. Had as mid, well et villa sengem gart geschaft Hewitt, that's Natalie. She is tired because she has worked a lot in her garden. Adjectives Luxembourgish morphology distinguishes two types of adjective, attributive and predicative. Predicative adjectives appear with verbs like shin, to be, and receive no extra ending. De man as grouse, masculine. The man is tall. Defra as grouse, feminine. The woman is tall. De meechen as grouse, neuter. The girl is tall. De canner see grouse, plural. The children are tall. Attributive adjectives are placed before the noun they describe, and change their ending according to the grammatical gender, number, and case. De grouse man, masculine. Dei grouse fra, feminine. Dat graust Mädchen, neuter. Dei graust Kanner, plural. Curiously, the definite article changes with the use of an attributive adjective. Feminine D goes to Dei or D, neuter D goes to Dat, and plural D changes to Dei. The comparative in Luxembourgish is formed analytically, i.e. the adjective itself is not altered. Compare the use of er in German and English: tall, taller, klein, kleiner. Instead, it is formed using the adverb mei, e.g. Schein mei Schein. Letzebjörg as mei shei esh. Luxembourg is prettier than esh. The superlative involves a synthetic form consisting of the adjective and the suffix street, e.g. schein schenst compare German schonst, English prettiest. Attributive modification requires the emphatic definite article and the inflected superlative adjective d schenst a man, the most handsome man. Dei schenst fra, the prettiest woman. Predicative modification uses either the same adjectival structure or the adverbial structure m plus sten, e.g. schein m schengsten. Letzebjörg as d schengsten, den aller schengsten, m schengsten. Luxembourg is the most beautiful of all. Some common adjectives have exceptional comparative and superlative forms. 
Gut, Besser, and Beskton, Good, Better, Best. Vil, Mai, and Mishkton, Much, More, Most. Wineg, Manor, and Manston, Few, Fewer, Fewest. Several other adjectives also have comparative forms. However, these are not commonly used as normal comparatives, but in special senses. Al, old, eeler late, elderly people, but may all late, older people, people older than X. Frey, early, de Freyer president, the former president, but e may Freyon Terman, an earlier appointment. Long, long, viru langer zate, some time ago. But Njmai long zate, a longer period of time. Topic: <inaudible> Word order. Luxembourgish exhibits verb second. Word order in clauses. More specifically, Luxembourgish is a V2SOV language, like German and Dutch. In other words, we find the following finite clausal structures. The finite verb in second position in declarative clauses and wh question sesh kaffen en hut. Muir kaffen ek en hut lit. I buy a hat. Tomorrow buy I a hat. Wat kaffen ek hot? Lit. What buy I today? The finite verb in first position in yes, no questions and finite imperatives based amid. Are you tired? Jeff mir dang hand. Give me your hand. The finite verb in final position in subordinate clauses do weis, dat ek mid shin, lit. You know, that I tired am. Non-finite verbs infinitives and participles generally appear in final position. Compound past tensesesh hun en hut calf, lit. I have a hat bought. Infinitival complements do sols net esu vil coffee drinken, lit. You should not so much coffee drink. Infinitival clauses, e.g., used as imperatives, nem Letzebergisch Schwatzen, lit. Only Luxembourgish speak. These rules interact so that in subordinate clauses, the finite verb and any non-finite verbs must all cluster at the end. Luxembourgish allows different word orders in these cases. Hie Frit, ob ek kom kon, cf. German er frat, ob ik komen kon. Hie Frit, ob ek ka komen, cf. Dutch hijvraagt of ik kan komen. This is also the case when two non finite verb forms occur together. Ek hun net ken komen, cf. Dutch ik heb niet kunnen komen. Ek hun net kom kennen, cf. German ik heb nicht komen kannen. Luxembourgish like Dutch and German allows prepositional phrases to appear after the verb cluster in subordinate clauses. Alice, Watt der Emmer Wolt Wessen Iwer Letzebjörg. Lit. Everything what you always wanted know about Luxembourg. Topic: Vocabulary. Luxembourgish has borrowed many French words. For example, the name for a bus driver is Buschauffeur also Dutch and Swiss German, which would be busfahrer in German and chauffeur de bus in French. Some words are different from standard German but have equivalents in German dialects. An example is Gromperen potatoes, German, Kartoffeln. Other words are exclusive to Luxembourgish. Topic. Selected common phrases Listen to the words below. Note, words spoken in sound clip do not reflect all words on this list. Neologisms Neologisms in Luxembourgish include both entirely new words, and the attachment of new meanings to old words in everyday speech. The most recent neologisms come from the English language in the fields of telecommunications, computer science, and the Internet. Recent neologisms in Luxembourgish include Direct loans from English, browser, spam, CD, fitness, come back, terminal, hip, cool, tip-top Also found in German, Sickmaschen, search engine, German, Suchmaschine, Schwarz latch, black hole, German, Schwarz's lock, handy, mobile phone, website, webpage, German, website Native Luxembourgish Dake is an emphatic like Gans and Vol, e.g. Desse kuch as dake gut. This cake is really good. 
Recent expressions, used mainly by teenagers, O oh melon, O oh crazy, N date gelangt, you've been tricked, or cassé, French for, you've been owned. Topic: Academic projects. Between 2000 and 2002, Luxembourgish linguist Jérôme Lulling compiled a lexical database of 125,000 word forms as the basis for the very first Luxembourgish spellchecker, ProJC Ort, in a. The LAF, Letzburgish ALS Fremsprüch, Luxembourgish as a foreign language, is a set of four language proficiency certifications for Luxembourgish and follows the ALTE framework of language examination standards. The tests are administered by the Institut National des Langues Luxembourg, the Centre for Luxembourg Studies at the University of Sheffield was founded in 1995 on the initiative of Professor Gerald Newton. It is supported by the Government of Luxembourg which funds an endowed chair in Luxembourg Studies at the university. The first class of students to study the language outside of the country as undergraduate students began their studies at the Centre for Luxembourg Studies at Sheffield in the academic year 2011-2012. See also Erna Hennecott Schoges Literature of Luxembourg Luxembourgish Swadesh List Multilingualism in Luxembourg <laughs> Footnotes <laughs>